Hello, welcome to Empress Moon Tarot 777. This is the weekly reading for the sign of Leo. Leo, sun, moon, and rising signs. Leo, I hope that you're doing absolutely phenomenal. Please keep in mind that this is not time sensitive. So this, you know, if you're ever drawn back to this video at any point in time, it may be your video then. Please also keep in mind that because it is a general reading, not everything in this reading will resonate with you. Take the parts that do, but sweep away that which does not. All right, Leo, let's see what we have for you for this week. Spirit for Leo. Ooh, right here at the center of your spread, we have the Seven of Wands. So, Leo, this tells me that you are holding on tight to something that you care very deeply about. Um, this could be in any area of your life. It does not have to be in love. It could be with regards to career. It could be with regards to a project or something that's very exciting to you. Some new direction you want to move in. But the Seven of Wands, especially with the heart here in the center, is holding on tight, fighting off the competition. Perhaps if we're dealing with a love situation, you could be fighting off the competition for somebody that you care about. Um, if, you know, this could be you fighting off the competition that's trying to come in and, and steal you away from somebody that you care about as well. Regardless of whatever area this, this is, this is something very important to you, whether it's a person, a situation, a career, whatever it may be, something of a great importance. Right at the bottom of your spread, Leo, we have the Justice card. This tells me in this particular situation, you are hoping for some sort of karmic justice. Perhaps you've put some work and effort into this area of your life. And knowing that you've been working very hard to protect what it is that you have, you're hoping to see some positive movement in that area. Right now, I see that things are not currently balanced, but that you're hoping for things to move towards a very positive direction recent past for leo please oh spirit wanted you to have two cards we will go with that so in the recent past there's been some movement towards happiness or towards some sort of clarity uh, the chariot in this particular deck is on the victory lap. So you are moving towards victory. You are moving towards happiness. You're moving towards peace. There was the recognition that you were almost at the finish line. So I'm wondering what happened here, Leo, because here we have you holding on tight to something that may have been slipping from your grasp and you weren't aware. Um, it's possible that something has, you know, started to slip from your grasp and, grasp, and here you are previously on this victory lap wanting to to move towards it let's see what else we've got what's on leo's mind what's on leo's mind oh my leo the seven of swords eight of swords well as i said it looks like somebody may have been slipping through your grasp because here you are fighting to hold on to it and here you are worried and fearful. Perhaps somebody's walked away from you, Leo, and you're not sure how to handle it. Or perhaps you've walked away from somebody else. Um, there may be uh, some situations where you're dealing with, you know, other people, since this is also fighting off people who are trying to interfere. You may be dealing with people gossiping or people speaking poorly about you, and here you are worried and fearful over the situation. We'll look at this from a, a love perspective here in just a moment, Leo. Near future for Leo, please, in this situation. Near future for Leo in this situation. Okay, good. Boy, you're chatty today. We were given three. Look at that, the lovers, the fool, the ace of wands making a decision with regards to love, having a brand new start, a brand new passionate start here and, and making that leap of faith with somebody that you care about deeply. So Leo, you know, it looks like, 
it looks like we had a situation in which you found yourself very happy with the person. Um, there was forward movement, yes. There was the uh, the ability to move past any kind of you know barriers or roadblocks, yes, absolutely. Um, great deal of happiness, great deal of forward movement. Feeling as if, all right, Leo, <laughs> round and round. Oh, let's see what else we've got, and then let's address this even deeper. One more for Leo, please. One more. Uh, awesome, 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 awesome. Down at the bottom of the deck, we have to be fair. I'm placing that with justice because it's super important. Immediately preceding that, we also have thinker that appears to go at the top. So let's address this, Leo. And then we're going to need to move on. So Leo, there is a person, we're looking at this from love now, Leo. There is a person that you felt very happy with, that you thought things were moving forward with. Um, you felt very good about the direction things were moving in. You were probably trying to figure out, you know, how to make make things happen. You know, what do you do from, from here? What, How to make things um, move in a positive direction, right? But yet, we also received round and round. So despite the forward movement, despite the happiness, despite the, the fact that with this person you felt victory, there was a situation in which you were going round and round. Perhaps you were going round and round in your head because we do have this, these worries and these fears about what other people are saying and thinking and doing. Um, but it, it could just be that you felt previously as if your life was like this constant cycle of difficulties, struggles, trials, and then here comes this person that brings great happiness and it's like, now, finally, you're on the victory lap. Now, finally, you can move beyond these difficulties, these struggles. But yet, in your mind, you're allowing, you're allowing, with thinker and these, these two cards, you're allowing the, the things that other people are saying to interfere with your relationship. You're allowing deception. Perhaps you were deceptive with your person. You didn't tell them everything. Perhaps you didn't tell them how you were feeling. Perhaps you didn't tell them that you wanted to move forward with them. Because here you are worried and fearful. It's almost like, it's almost like this, this person appears to be too good to be true almost to you. And then here you may have been, you may have been thinking over and over again of any possible flaw, any kind of difficulty you could be seeing in the situation. And it's causing worries and fears of your own making with that eight of swords. But yet you're holding on tight to them in your heart. You're fighting off the competition. Perhaps you're fighting off the competition for this person. Holding on to them in your heart. Trying to ignore the comments of other people. Trying to ignore, you know, other people's involvement in the situation. But right now, things are not, things are not equal. You want them to be, but they're not. Perhaps because this person doesn't know how you're feeling. Perhaps this person doesn't realize that you're fighting for the connection. But moving forward in the near future, if you work on being a co-creator of your world, you work on manifesting this love, manifesting this situation. Here we have a love decision being made, deciding to take that leap of faith for a passionate new restart with this person. Perhaps you weren't giving them a chance because of all those worries and those fears. And then here we have this future, this forward movement. You choose them or they choose you. Let's see. All right. Leo, first you got let go of control issues. Allow this situation to unfold naturally. Um, especially with this, this mental energy, whatever it is you're holding on to, 
that's causing you to feel a sense of control of the situation. It's harming, it's harming the connection. So do let go of any kind of control issues you have with this love situation. And true love, true love here, Leo. This is the romance of a lifetime. You already know this person. This is somebody you already know. This is true love. This is somebody you want to be with. And see the angel trying to bring these two together? It's like this little chair. It's like time to bring these two together. You're holding on tight to this person, Leo, and you are moving forward. Um, let's take a look in the extended to see, you know, how this person is going to be reacting, what's going on with this person. Because um, they may go, be going through a similar energy. But we'll take a look at their energy, see what's happening here. And we'll take a look at the potential outcome um, if you move towards this person and take that leap of faith. All right, so if you're going to be joining me for the extended link down below, and I'll see you there shortly. If not, until your next video, have an absolutely wonderful, wonderful day, Leo, and I'll see you soon.